What's up, everybody? Welcome to the Action Sofa. We are playing Toe Jam and Earl, uh, as you can see. Oh yeah. <laughs> uh, I will be playing as Earl, and Duncan will be playing as Toe Jam. I'll be the big guy, he'll be the little guy, because that's how it is in real life. Toe Jam and Earl. Play new game. Uh, random world? I guess. All right. All right, I think oh. I'm I think I'm Earl. So we switched. Let's switch. Huh. Oops. Our console just dropped on the floor. Because we have cables like savages. <laughs> so Duncan is going to quickly get up and run over there. Huh. <laughs> I'm going to scavenge these presents. <laughs> Steady on, young one. Steady on. I got it. I got it. Good enough. So I I have only ever played this like once a long, long time ago. Uh, and it was for... Oop, Toe Jam just fell asleep. It was for like two hours. So I've never played through this whole game. But you have, Duncan, right? I have. So the deal with this game is... Uh, oh, yeah. Hey, wake up. Wake up. Okay, that's what that button does. So the deal with this game is that uh, we are Toe Jam and Earl, and we are aliens. If you couldn't tell. <laughs> uh, yeah, and we are from another planet, and we have crash-landed our spaceship on Earth because we are apparently not very good at the driving of the spaceship. And uh, so we are, we have crash landed on Earth and our spaceship parts have, uh, have been scattered around the Earth and we need to go find them. Um, this is where it gets kind of weird because as you can see, we've just gotten into an elevator of sorts. And now we're on some sort of sky platform. And we'll, we'll just be going up and down on these platforms trying to find spaceship yes. junk. So, so we are... do any of our buttons do anything other than bring up the map? Yeah, so uh, B brings up the, uh, the our inventory. So we're going to be picking up a bunch of items, and it's going to be important for us to, uh, to, to, to use these items properly because they will let us do things. So, like, the high tops allow us to move really fast. Oh, okay. Um, we're also going to pick up things like, uh, like tomatoes that we can throw at enemies, like that little devil guy right there. Um, oh. Whoop. <laughs> you just picked up a watermelon. So yeah, we're gonna be able to do that, and uh, and and we'll we'll pick up uh, basically we'll pick up a bunch of items that allow us to 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 do stuff. Ah, uh, my legs don't know how to be as long as yours. Just like in real life. <laughs> just like in real life, me just sort of. Uh, hmm. Whoop. One thing that's nice about this game is you go to an edge and see how I almost fell off there, but I didn't. This is the other nice thing, is it goes to split screen if you get whoop, too far away. Ow. Ow. Stop getting beat up. I'm trying. If I see any food, I will hold it for you. Ooh, presents. Yeah, we have, uh, we have a health bar that we fill up by eating food. But we don't want to eat rotten food. Okay, I didn't know even, there was even rotten food, so that's good to know. I think there is. It'll be, it'll be yucky and it won't... It won't nourish It'll us. It'll be obviously rotten food. Hey, devil guy, you want to get the hell out of here? Get out of here, you jerk. Actually, you know what? Just stay right there where you are. Yeah. <laughs> he kind of reminds me of the old old Dutch uh, mascots. <laughs> With the big roundy nose and the... <laughs> yeah. Okay, how do we... Uh, let's let's uh, let's see if we can't just get around this guy right here. Whoa. Sucker! Oh, yeah, there we go. That's the stuff. And yeah, there we go. I'm like Chris Farley. I'm quick for a fat guy. Very <laughs> agile. <laughs> we should figure out. Ooh, there's a pizza. We I'm gonna go eat that pizza. Snatch that up. 
Now, viewers at home, I wouldn't recommend that you wander around and eat pizza that you find on the floor. Ooh. But if you are in a survival situation, like for instance, if you crash land on a planet and you just you just got to do it, then, you know, like, you know, do what you got to do, right? I recommend even less if you crash on an alien planet eating food that you find lying on the ground. But like Duncan says, if, if it's for survival, you bear grills that. Bear grills that shit. Just shove it up your butt or whatever you need to do. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead as well and mention that you probably shouldn't shove pizza up your butt. That, yeah, just, just don't do that. Ever. <laughs> Even if your frat brothers tell you it's a good idea. <laughs> Alright, do we have everything? Is there a way of knowing if you've found everything? Um, not quite. Uh, it looks like we need to go down to the left there. Okay. Yeah, I think there's some way of we found the elevator. The elevator will get us to the next level. Yeah. Which is good. Um, but there's no way of knowing whether I don't know if there's any way of knowing whether we found the spaceship part or not. Whoa. Unless we just kind of. Whoop! Hey there, little red devil. You want to follow me? Come on, buddy. Come on. Psych. <laughs> Chumped him out. Alright, so there's stuff going on over to the right here. If I were to escape this. What? There's another little devil man. I'm just gonna move my move my boom here for a second. Uh, I hope that wasn't too loud. Or Odds awful. are very good. I will just cut that whole thing out. Okay, I've un. I've uncovered this section of the map. The fog of war is now lifted, um, and there's nothing here. So, all right, we may we may want to consider. Uh, Whoa! Ah, that's right. Pathways sometimes open up. Good to know. Uh, okay, well, I found a secret path somehow. Ah. <laughs> um, which also leads nowhere. So now you're on the level below. So yeah, now I'm on the level below. And you'll notice that in the top right corner uh, of each of our screens, you'll see a, a number. And that's the that's the level that we happen to be on right now. Do we have uh, discernible lives or anything? Um, Whoa. Another secret island. Yeah, I think... I, I'm not sure what happens if we die. Hmm. Or if we, okay. yeah, if we lose all our health or whatever it is. Okay, well, while I'm waiting for you, I'm going to... Uh, Earl on over to the right here and see if there's anything else to uncover. Look at you, just Earling all over the place. Earling like Merlin. Oh, there you are. <laughs> Yo, Earl, what's up? Yeah, these guys are these guys are totally like funky fresh, funky fresh '90s dudes, which is awesome. Uh, tell I'm glad because of the hot kicks and the cool clock around. Toe jams neck. Yep, exactly. Hmm. I'm just, I'm glad that the 90s made it to their planet. It's just, it's, it's a nice thing. That's all I'm saying. So this would be a thing where um, we would, we could use an item to get over there. So there's things ah. like, uh, there's things like Icarus wings that actually allow you to fly. Cool. That was weird. <laughs> it was weird. Okay, looks like that's all for us. Could you jump down from a, a higher level? Uh, I think you could, but I think you'd need to you need to be fairly precise about it. <laughs> there might not be an opportunity to do that. Hold on one sec. Yeah. And that would mean going all the way back down to one, because you'd have to jump off that level again. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so we could probably just head into the elevator then, yeah? Yeah, it is elevator time. Whoop. I'm in the elevator, you can't see me. Woo! Bing! So yeah, I am very unclear as to what exactly the uh, the elevators are meant to represent or why the earth is uh, Split into is a series chunks. of yeah, is a series of chunks, but um, or why there are presents everywhere. But uh, do you not find presents everywhere you go when you go out for a walk? Ooh, it's a hula lady. It's a siren. Don't get near her. She'll make you dance. <laughs> Look at me dance. Look at me dance. 
<laughs> okay, let's get past her and try and get that present. Yeah, the the thing I love about this game is that uh, so the idea is that you know rather than rather than being you know humans who are stuck in in some horrible alien nightmare or whatever it is, we are aliens who are stuck in a horrible human nightmare. So all of the stuff that kills us are things that you know are like you know different different things that you would find on Earth. So there's things like yeah the, the little devils, and there's the boogeyman. Oh really? And there's a hamster in a ball. There, yeah, that is a hamster in a ball. Mail order. I could order something. Sure. Oh, I can buy stuff. Oh neat. I gotcha. I only got three bucks. I only got three bucks. Whoop! I just woke up that hamster. Maybe I won't buy anything. Is there a way to sneak? Should we be sneaking around? Uh. Oh, there is. If you hold down the A button, you sneak. Oh, nice. There we go. Yeah, that is important. <laughs> no. Oh, crap. This hula lady is going to kill me. Yep. Or get me killed. Yeah, I'm currently dealing with my own hula lady <laughs> predicament. Uh, Do you know how many pieces of spaceship we need to find? Whoop. Um, no, I'm sure it would say that in the instruction manual, which we will maybe uh, maybe take a look at. In between episodes? In between episodes. Because, uh... Oh. Yo, world! What's, What's up? up? Toe just, jam! Just a sleeping hamster over that way. Okay. <laughs> There's nothing for us there. Hooray! There we go. We found some... Secrets. Whoop. Not fall off. Oh. Yeah, you can get past this guy. And okay, so there's a wizard. Oh, there's the elevator. Are wizards? Hold on a minute. Yes. Okay. I think I may have paid that wizard a dollar for something. There are fireworks going on around me. All right. <laughs> I think you leveled up. Sweet. Yes, you leveled up. So when we're both on the screen, you'll see that we each have a title. Mm -hmm. And right now, I think I'm at Wiener. And uh, you just upgraded to Doofus. Sounds about right. How do we level up exactly? <laughs> Uh, I don't know. That would be a good thing for the, uh... Oh, crap. <laughs> I sneezed and woke up the devil. That's kind of funny, actually. That's pretty hilarious. Oh, there's a telephone. Ow. Crap. Um, hmm. So I'm caught between two devils here. Well, it looks like you're heading to a whole lot of nowhere, but keep on keeping on. I may need to just fall here, because... Oh, wait, no. Maybe I can jump this. Is that a... Oh, bummer! Oh. I was too busy watching you. <laughs> <laughs> and then you just fell. We woke up that devil. Oh, yeah. Earl is a doofus. Look at that. He sure is. Wait. Mm. There we go. Oh, Oop, other way. Other way. <laughs> I know where I'm going. Good call with that map. <laughs> All right, let's get in this elevator and let's get the hell out of here. Yep. We'll get back to level three. Uh, and then you'll see more of level three next time on the action sofa. <laughs>